openness is a key driving force behind the progress of human civilizations and an intrinsic path toward global prosperity and development. The electronic sand table that depicts the Hainan Free Trade Port's construction landscape, the simulation driving cabin at the Jakarta Bandung high speed train, a glasses free 3D video of Pinglu Canal Project, which is an important part of China's new International Land Sea Trade Corridor. These are some of the exhibits on an exhibition themed 10 years of the new era that epitomizes China's achievements, especially the ones that feature opening up. For 10 years, China's average contribution to global economic growth keeps at around 30%, making itself the biggest engine for global economic growth. China is the largest trading partner for over 120 countries and regions in the world and such friend circle is still expanding. During these 10 years, the year 2013 marks an important chapter. In 2013, Chinese President Xi Jinping put forward the significant Belt and Road Initiative, chartering a brand new course of common prosperity and development for the world. This year, China established its first pilot free trade zone in Shanghai and released the first special management measures, negative list, for foreign investment access in pilot free trade zones. Now 21 pilot free trade zones, which occupy less than 4,000th of China's land, account for 17.3% of the country's import and export, and absorb 18.5% of total foreign investment. The number of items on the negative list has reduced from 190 at the beginning to the current 27. The Foreign Investment Law of the People's Republic of China which was enacted in 2020, has built a new regulation system for foreign investment. Opening up to the outside world is a fundamental national policy that China is committed to. It has also become a vivid feature of modern China. In 2022, the RCEP officially came into force, marking the creation of a free trade bloc with the biggest population and largest trade scale. Hence, a breakthrough has been achieved regarding free trade zone development. China's development cannot be achieved without the world, and the world also needs China for its development. For 10 years, China has been taking initiatives in participating in global economic governance and keeps making new contributions. In 2014, China has worked with 21 member countries to adopt the Beijing Roadmap for APEC's contribution to the realization of the Free Trade Area of the Asia-Pacific FTAAP. China has also contributed to the adoption of the G20 Guiding Principles for Global Investment Policymaking at the 2016 G20 Hongzhou Summit, which laid a solid foundation for the Investment Facilitation Initiative launched by WTO members in 2017. What's more, China has been an active member in WTO reforms and a staunch defender of multilateral trading systems. Lu 